Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all the Pisces, Sun, Moon and Rising sign. I want to say thank you, thank you to all you Pisces out there. This has been so wonderful. It has been just a wonderful, wonderful time. Thank you for your support, your like and share for this channel. Welcome all newcomers, welcome all the subscribers. And please subscribe to this channel, thumbs up, likes and share these videos. This is the last week of July 2017 and we begin from the 24th until the 30th so this is good over in five days you can pick up your energy vibration reading for the month of August as we look at your week your number is going to be the number three and the number 33 on Monday we have the energy of the devil in reverse and this is good this is going to be extremely good because um, six and two is eight you are going to have uh, um, you're moving away from something that no longer serve you and this is extremely good you're just moving away from something that no longer serve you and uh, the week is the week of the hamper the week of the hamper is a fire week uh, the zodiac energy of the fire and on Monday you had the, the devil the devil is that you're moving away from a situation that no longer serve you on Tuesday you have the energy of the uh, king of Pentacles which this is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn person so some people will have the energy vibration of different whether the Capricorn the Virgo or the Taurus and you have the energy this um, king is going to bring in and show you um, wonderful wonderful ways of uh, making money and that sort of a thing but he's going to awaken um, your inner guidance and your inner spirit because he's bringing a magician whenever a king is bringing a magician he is helping you to bring magic in your life and to bring stability because the king of Pentacles is always about stability it's always about business money and that sort of a thing so this is good for you to have a stable energy in the week in the middle of the week you have the energy of the three of arts and and loss of something and um, this has to do with the, the the queen of wands so whatever the situation is this queen of wands is bringing a loss in your life of something and it doesn't really matter because um, whenever um, the three of arts comes up which is the three of swords uh, um, it is uh, heartbreak of something something that um, is lost and it's okay because uh, um, whenever we lost something we always gain something much better than what it was okay as we look at Tuesday we have the energy vibrate uh, Thursday we have the energy vibration of the king of cups your own self is in your reading so this is good so on Thursday for you men your intuition is going to be extremely high so for um, the men in this um, week on Thursday your intuition is going to be extremely high listen to your intuition as you listen to your intuition you can't go wrong with anything in your life as we move forward on Friday we have the energy of the four of Pentacles the four of Pentacles to bring in stability to your financial world and this is very good and it doesn't really matter if someone think that you're holding on tight to your money it is okay to hold on tight you need to save you need to have something in the back and you're having a heart break with this so here we have two times um, the three of swords and the three of swords is always a thought of loss something that you are about to lo lose or something that you have lost and it's okay because when you lose something there is always something better that is going to replace the place so whatever the financial situation was whatever that has been lost you're going to regain it on Saturday you have the energy of the star this is wonderful the star has been coming up for a lot of people whatever is happening and then good news is coming in okay so whatever is happening if you had manifest something in your life and uh, here you are good news is coming in the star energy is the energy of the hair it is your guides and angels bringing in good things to you so listen to your intuition whoever you are for the women on Saturday it is going to be a wonderful profound day because uh, the energy of something new what you have, uh, uh, have manifest is going to come in on Sunday we have the three of Pentacles another three so you have three um, 33 and 333 this is a wonderful energy for you because if you're working on a project or something with someone it's going to be an extreme success 
good news is coming into you so this is what I mean whenever you see the energy of the three of swords always so when there's a loss there's going to be replaced with something which is much much better than you can ever dream of because your guides and angels is just removing you away from the energy of the devil and they're making sure that you let go of what you no longer learn uh, need and learn and you are going to find yourself to some place that is so much more beautiful than you have ever thought okay so whatever is happening your focus for the week is the wheel of fortune so this is wonderful and this is given a very 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 positive outlook on your week because what is happening is that a, a whole lot of losses is happening uh, for some people if you're having a relationship with uh, the energy vibration of a fire sign person uh, for the men and you're having um, a situation with a fire sign person and this person decide to um, you know move away from the relationship it's going to be okay because it's going to be replaced with something that is much better someone who is much better a different situation that is much better whatever the situation was you have learned your lesson and you're moving on what I should say because the wheel of fortune is very beautiful and for you Pisces whenever you are carrying the wheel of fortune in a week you because you work with a spirit world your spirit world is going to bring positive endeavor in your life and this is going to be good as we look at the first part of the week we have a situation with the king of Pentacles and he is going to come in your life to bring magic in your life and what we mean by magic and this king of Pentacles whatever your business endeavor whatever is happening in your world this king of Pentacles a Taurus a Virgo a Capricorn person is going to enter your life and bring a new situation and magical a resolution to whatever is going on and then you're just going to let go of whatever is happening and walk away from it let go move away from it because whatever was there you've learned the lessons and you're moving on and you're accepting it and what is going to be the outcome is that the energy of the star is going to be a wonderful energy good news um, is coming in so most of the times we have a, a sense of uh, yeah letting go of things it's very hard for us to let go of things but as we let go of things that no longer serve us you will see that universal angels is going to open up positive positive things in our lives as we look at the second half of the week we have yourself and we have the energy of the king of cups this energy of the king of cups is going to be very significant for the men and the men on Thursday you really need to open up yourself to your intuition listen to your inner guides and they are going to guide you to a perfect place and wherever that is you are going to be working together with other people to bring forth things and good news is about to come in so it's not going to affect the men alone but the men need to listen because the women are always listening you Pisces women are always on top and listen to your intuition and what is happening now is that whatever that has happened um, the universal angels are asking you to listen to your inner guidance your inner guidance stop listening to people and listen to your inner guidance whatever the situation is with money and you're feeling heartbroken or you're feeling a loss with money you don't have to worry about that because it's going to return to you and it's going to return to you in a whole lot okay so whatever is happening with money and you have felt a loss it's going to return to you it doesn't really matter crowning your reading is the three of arts and whatsoever is happening to you guys and whatsoever you're about to lose this fire sign woman is the person who is going to be letting this happen so if you're in a relationship with this woman and she decides to leave the relationship it's okay you have learned a lesson whatever karmatic situation it is because the wheel of fortune is here so it's obviously a karmatic situation you're going to realize that it is okay you can let go of this person you can understand look at the lesson look at all what you have learned from this person and accept it and move on with your life do not stay in the stagnant state of you being so worried in this week love is not one of the most um, inspirational um, 
as speaking this week it's more about you bringing balance to whatever you have lost um, the wheel of fortune it's bringing you good news is bringing you back something so whatever that was lost on Friday in a monetary aspect on Saturday the star is going to come in and it's going to return that to you and on Sunday good news is going to so in then the, the beginning of the next week you're going to have good news about your financial situation okay so love is not going to be one of the most significant things that will be playing in this week and it's okay because not all the time we are allowed to have the energy vibration there are certain aspects and certain things of our lives that we need to work out on so remember the number three the number 33 and the number 333 is going to be your energy vibration your number energy vibration um, what's happening also is that uh, um, there are specific things that are working in this week with you I'm using the energy vibration of uh, the message from the abundance universe because it's the last week and let's see what we have you have then the color orange you have the color orange as we look at the card it's a wonderful card um, we have been get, we have been receiving wonderful cards from the angels and guides in this week. Whatever is happening, a lot of people have been receiving wonderful messages um, from the angels and guides in this week, and it's going to be wonderful. And it says, "One of abundance, many collaboration is the brighter your light." The more you attract everything, months and betters, butterflies, at which point you bring learning to what celebrates and what uh, to let fly by of whom. Okay, so what is this saying? Fame is on the rising. Look how beautiful it is. And a butterfly is here. And one of abundancy, many collaboration, is that the brighter your light shines, the more you attract everything you need. A moth and a butterfly, because first you have a moth and then you have a butterfly, at which point you begin to learn what to celebrate and what to leave or fly uh, let fly by and this is good because this is another time that this card has been coming up so you know you need to learn um, to understand what uh, you can keep and what you can just let fly by because you don't really need that energy as we look at the, the e oracle let's see what does the e oracle have for the Pisces in this week and it's going to be magic carpet oh my god this is wonderful because um I did the Sagittarius reading and they got the jackpot and now you got to the magic carpet and this is good so let's see what the magic carpet has to say for you which is supposed to be a very good message when the magic carpet comes out the magic carpet the magic carpet um, go ahead open it up your invitation for a personal magical carpet ride to anywhere you want to go you don't even need to send an RSVP. Jump aboard, my friend. You are on your way to enchanted enchantment and miracles so this is wonderful I'm sorry I so love magic and I wish if uh, people would start understanding that magic really exists and again it says go ahead open it up your uh, invitation for a personal magical carpet ride to anywhere you want to go you don't even need to um, send and um, send out an RVS jump aboard my friend and you are on your way to enchantment and miracles and this is so wonderful so again these are the two cards that you got and these are extremely beautiful let me show you the writing on it uh, this one doesn't have any writing but this one does so um, this is from this is from the e oracle the magical carpet and this is the message that you have from the um, abundance um, universe and I want to say to each and every person thank you so much from my heart to your heart I'm so grateful for your help you Pisces I so love the Pisces um, people you are such a wonderful wonderful um, group of people who came in on this 
this planet to um, teach us love as I hold the energy vibration of love myself whatever is happening whatever loss you're going to you know lose that because something better is going to come in um, it's going to be an emotional loss for some people and it's going to be um, monetary loss for some people but it's going to be okay because whoever is leaving your life uh, it's time for them to leave uh, and whoever and whatever money which is not a lot which you're going to lose uh, you are going to gain it back so you have nothing to worry about because you have the wheel of fortune so I want to say to each and every person I'm sending you love and pure light and I'm wishing you a wonderful week and I want to say to each and every one love is the only thing that is real and whenever we understand that and whenever we vibrate with the energy vibration of love our lives will just bloom as if by a flower namaste